Don't worry about him knocking you off. <laughs> so, uh, what do you think? You what do you think? You're one of these calendar girls or something? Do you? <laughs> <laughs> the Ernie, leave mummy alone. <laughs> I thought it'd be like, yeah, that's it, like a calendar pose, I thought. Yeah, sort of. Sort of something like that, I suppose. <laughs> Obviously, we've got too much time on our hands, guys. <laughs> anyway, the dog's chewing his leaf. Lovely setting, though. Beautiful day today. This is the afternoon now of the 12th of January. Yes. Hello guys, I left you at lock 5 last time, we're uh, sitting at lock 7 at the moment, so got a nice vlog coming up for you, um, hope you enjoy it. Have you got your dressing gown on, Ernie? Uh, cut to the chase, I fell in. <laughs> fell in what? <laughs> fell in the canal. Oh dear. First, First time. time. Tree boat and now. High yeah. five. High five. High five. High five properly. Good boy. <laughs> High five. Yes. Proper boater. Good boy. God, you stink. Yeah, it was quite funny actually because he kind of went. <laughs> He's just sort of poodling along the edge. Oh, I still had him on lead, actually. And one, one of his uh, back legs slid in. So he sort of spun round, followed by the second <laughs> back leg. Followed by, he just sort of s slid in, really. So can you swim? Yep. Mm. First time he's been in deep water. <laughs> oh dear, Vans. The rest of Atherston Locks to do today. So we've got four more locks. Paul's going to be coming along in a minute. I'm just setting this lock here. And then that's the Atherston 11 completed. It's taken us a little while because we've stopped in between. And it's been really lovely, but now on to something new. Beautiful day for it. Really lovely day. We had a nice couple of days yesterday. We sat outside the boat without coats on. Oh, fancy that, eh? Some of these gates are really quite tough. Oh, this is a stiff one. <laughs> so cold. Always keep an eye on the boat in there, make sure it's not coming forward too much, getting trapped on the gates, or obviously making sure that Paul is off the seal at the back. So never rush a lock, just take your time. Even if people are waiting for you, they're not. Even if they are, do what's right for you. We've had, we had an incident on the um, Oxford South where a working boat was in a rush. We should have let him go really, but we were sort of already in the lock and he just came up I was closing the gate and he'd come to the front and literally just let all the paddles up all at once and our boat came shooting forward, knocked our nose off. It was, it was really quite bad. 
So just take your time. And don't be frightened to, if somebody offers you to help, don't be frightened to sort of say to them, yep, yeah, but only open it halfway, please. You know, do, just because they're helping it doesn't mean they have to rush it. You, they do it at whatever your speed is. I didn't get a chance to uh, tell the bloke on the, the Oxford because by the time I'd come up the front, he'd already opened every single paddle. So, right, let's open this last bit. Ready to go out under there and to the next one. Thousand kilograms that gate. Nice to know. She's not quite brave enough to jump over yet. She's still doing the long walk round. Mind you, it is safer. Right, out we go then. You're getting on. Okay. You might as well get on. <laughs> get off my boat. What a glorious day, eh? Hey? It certainly is. Stanley. Yeah, really lovely day. Really lovely. Thanks, Sam. And he swapped his coat to his harness today, haven't you, Ernie? Yeah. You <laughs> good boy. Days like this that make it all worthwhile. All them muddy towpaths, the puddles, the cold weather, the wind, the rain. It's these sort of days that make it all worthwhile. <laughs> Done. Yes, and the old wind's picked up, isn't it, darling? Yeah. Grindon Wall, where we're at now. These are agreement holders, so perms over this side. Beautiful over there. Looks kind of beautiful. the sun and the trees. Stunning. I don't think it's quite picking up. Try and get the drone over there. But we've got services coming up, water, rubbish on the left after these boats. So we're going to do that and then find ourselves a nice little moment. There we are. Water time again. Rolo. <laughs> Rolo saying hello to Ernie. <laughs> like and subscribe. Well done. Remember to like and subscribe. <laughs> 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 She's taking the mick out of you, Ernst. I think she's taking the mick. You're going to time for that, are you? <laughs> nice mooring. Those trees down there look beautiful. The colours of the bushes. Yeah. 
so fast. He really is so fast. Yeah? Yeah. Best we've had for ages. Yeah. A bit of towpath that, isn't it, Alex? Yep. So what have you done to your husband this afternoon? In my defence, it was the Don't only... Don't... How can you say that? <laughs> it was the only co-op that was on the canal map that we use in Gwendon. Mm. So I've sent him to the bridge, even though Lucy and Rolo told us it was on their bridge by the mm. water point, mm. 15 minute walk from there. Yeah. With Paul's little legs, 25 minutes, she said. So 20, thank you. But I saw one on the map, which I assumed would be the same one, mm. and it, it was closer to go forward and across the bridge. Yeah, <laughs> you know, so forward, forward and across the bridge at 49. <laughs> Instead of going to the co-op in Grendon, <laughs> you sent me to the co-op co in, in Dordan. Dordan, yeah. And we're in Grendon. Yeah, and we're in Grendon. I've been gone near on three hours. <laughs> Don't you just love... Me? Nature? In the nice sun, and it started raining at one point. <laughs> at one point, I looked out the window and I was like, oh, shit, it's, it's raining. raining. And then I thought, yeah, I don't think he's even got his coat on him because it's been so nice. Oh, oh God, honestly, oh, I oh, I'm, got his coat. I'm absolutely knackered. <laughs> but in my mind, I thought, oh, well, that's the nearest one. Maybe Joyce has got it wrong. Joyce? <laughs> Not Joyce, is it? Lucy <laughs> and Lucy's got it wrong. It's both of them. <laughs> anyway, I am cream crackered. Got the milk there. <sighs> yeah. For the teeth. So I walked through the door. I went. You can guess who's taking the dog out for the afternoon <laughs> walk today. Yeah, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> All right. Thanks, wife. You're welcome. Sorry. Beautiful afternoon. It's, I think, about half five. Um, no, it's not. Half five it gets dark, isn't it? It's about four o'clock, I think. What a beautiful afternoon. What are we looking at? <laughs> Look at that. Springs on its way. I'll leave it out there. And very funny. Look at that. Springs <laughs> definitely on its way, isn't it? Yeah, we've got yes. back up oh, yes. down there as well. Yes, it's on its way, girl. Yeah. This one's got loads on. Oh, blimey, yeah. This one. Loads of green coming through. Oh. Well, it'll be interesting in the next couple of weeks, then, won't it, eh? Yeah, we'll really see a change. That. Got a sun downpour we had last night. Started about seven o'clock, really hard. Didn't stop till about half eight, nine o'clock this morning. Little waterfall there. 
Why do you? At least the horses have got plenty to drink. Morning. I know it's all about you, but can I say something quickly? You can, yeah. Uh, yeah. Um, a bit windier than we expected, ain't it? It is. <laughs> and today... Hang on a minute, to show the wind. Oh, that's done nothing. But it's believe not you, me, it is windy. You can see by my hair it's windy. <laughs> yeah. Um, anyway, today we're going to um, take you back. Oh, yeah. Well, not in memory form. <laughs> Take you back, actually physically, there's a boat coming actually behind us. This is what I'm worried about with the take me back. Because you've got up there the land that you saw earlier in the video, yeah. that all the water's coming off. We've got a part, and that's quite a by wash there from that. Sorry, um, do people at this stage realise that you're talking about us reversing back? Sorry, yeah. Instead of, I, I don't mean we're taking you back to memories, we're taking you back literally to on the, the boat. The we're reversing to the water point. Yeah. Because there isn't another one until Faisley Junction, and that's still quite away from us, so... Mm. So, our options then, really, weren't they? Now it's so windy, we're actually thought, talking about... Walking it back. Walking it back. And yeah. having a row beach, one bow, one stern, really, aren't we? Yeah. So, should we go with that? I think, to be honest, if I try and reverse back, if it's so windy, it will literally just put... We'll have to go, to, go with that until the, the bridge, and then you'll have to take yeah, over, because obviously it it's the, the wrong... Yeah, I think, let's give it a go with ropes, even if it takes 20 minutes half yeah. it takes what it takes, I think, I think the wind's just still a bit too close all over the place. Right, yeah. we'll crack on with that then, shall we? Yeah. OK. at the water point. I think we'd be able to buy that one up and do a bit of renovation on it. Uh... It's going to be out of our budget, the amount you'd have to spend on it, to be honest. <laughs> looks like you more likely to be able to make it into a vegetable garden or something, yeah. to be honest. It looks like it's already started to sort of do its own thing, hasn't it? I wonder how long it's been like that. 
Rwanda. In the distance there we have the river anchor, which has clearly burst its banks. Nice church in the background. Look at that. Everywhere is so wet. Seem to have got away with the cold this year, so far, but they've replaced it with the wet. River anchor, Ernie. Not what you just said. Down there, in the river. Ernie just got the name of the river anchor wrong. Yes. I'll leave that to your imagination. <laughs> <laughs> on that one mate <laughs> <laughs> Fine. 
but a quite busy towpath and Ernie's not the greatest with passing dogs. Passing dogs. Or people. Or people. Or things floating in the canal, which we seem to have a lot of here. <laughs> Here, 55 is where you just where we're just pulling away from now so we're going to probably try and sort of go just literally around the other side this motorway bridge here is the M42 every which way you've got trees and there she is there this is the morning after the night before non-stop rain up until about 10 in the morning look at the colour of that water obviously all the mud mix it in as it comes down and there's my favourite tree <laughs> Just taking Ernie out for a well earned walk. This is a great example of why canal water isn't nice and clear. <laughs> Look at the colour difference as it's coming in. That's a bit of a shame, that's the end of our walk then. I ain't going through that in my normal hiking boots. Don't go in, Ernst. <coughs> or drag me in. <laughs> Enough. That do early. Oh. Oh, it's like a double bridge. Wow. Obviously a bit lower most of the time because of uh, the graffiti. Hello guys, we finally moored up at Pooley Country Park. Park. Um, just had one night here already so far. Yeah, really nice. Um, yeah, so thanks very much for watching it. Um, and obviously look forward to you joining us next week for next week's adventures. And someone's got something to say. Don't forget to subscribe. Like, leave a comment and hit the ding bell. Thanks for watching. Bye, guys. Remember to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching again, guys. See you next week. See you week. next week.